Uh, we, we call it a showery pattern because, as Michelle just alluded to, it's not wet everywhere, but of course it's pouring in parts of Burnaby right now. We look at the satellite radar shot, you can see the flow coming in from the west southwest, and that'll keep circulating more showers near during the day, although there's a chance they'll just taper off altogether later this afternoon. But on the island, very unstable air swooping onto the west coast right now. Just saw a couple of lightning strikes out that direction. Tofino reporting some rain in 14, Victoria clouds in 13. 17 for a high over the southern island today, but there is a chance of an embedded thunderstorm in there, and you'll certainly see the the sun a few times this afternoon in Victoria, where you will not see any of it will be in Cedar Sky Country. That corridor between Squamish and Whistler staying choked up with clouds, staying cold throughout the day as well. All of a dozen degrees with some heavier showers in your Whistler forecast for today. And a similar outlook with a slightly milder conditions in the Fraser Valley. That breeze blowing in from the west southwest will just sort of clog up the eastern end of the valley with clouds. And 13 in Hope now it's 12 in Abbotsford and it's mostly wet throughout the day. Potential for some heavier showers. 16 degrees your valley high. And we can do one notch better in Metro Vancouver. Again, the idea is for a lot of showers this morning and then they'll ease off a little bit this afternoon. So maybe a glimmer of daylight before the day is done. 17 today. Tomorrow's still wet. 15 in the showers or 16. Uh, 17 by Wednesday as it clears up. So we get some sun Wednesday. We get more sun on Thursday and at the tail end of the week, an ever increasing chance of stronger uh, winds and more rain on Friday. Quite a mix in the, in the uh, forecast for autumn there, Riaz. Kind of sounds like autumn now, doesn't it?